All right, we're here with Ellen Noble on day one of Gloucester. Ellen, take us through the start of that race. It looks like you had a couple of moments that might have been a little tough, uh, maybe a little bumpy on the stairs. Take us through some of the early portions of today's race. Yeah, I, uh, I don't know. I kind of raced like a dummy today. I really couldn't. I really couldn't get my body to cooperate. I felt like I like I just got my body, and my brain's still trying to figure out how to use it today. Um, uh, so yeah, I made a, I made several mistakes. I think part of it came from I was really worried about the course. Uh, I was kind of counting on the elite free ride, and having the race go late meant that I didn't get. I only got to do two laps on course going into the race. So I was uh, I tried not to be nervous, but I definitely was because I would like to do more than two laps. So I got out there and I was like, all right, this is free ride and it's the race. So I just I just kind of went with it. But I, yeah, I was definitely making mistakes and it showed. But going into the last lap, it with Emma, it was really just a matter of her riding harder than me. It didn't come down to the cores or anything else. And I think that was my fear is I got, I knew I, going into the last lap, I was like, I don't really know how to win this race. And uh, that was kind of a frustrating feeling, but she ended up getting it and I'm happy for her. I was saying to Dave a couple minutes ago, we were fighting for the win here in 2011 and the three, four women. And it's funny to be doing that fighting for the win, like going into the last lap together at the front uh, in the, UCI races now. Awesome, yeah, it's so cool to see the two of you still battling now. Thank you. Congratulations, Antonio.